with these last few games here, you've got a chance to get a double bye. You've got a chance to, um, you know, secure a, a lot of positives for this season. What do you tell the guys coming into, I guess, this final stretch here? We just want to play as hard as we can play every single day, you know, and just try to be as good a team as we can be, overcome adversity, you know, try to be more consistent. You know, execute our, our actions better and just try to gear up for that Atlantic 10 tournament. How much do you, when, when is this the time of the season where you start to think about things like seeding and positioning for the tournament and stuff like that? I don't really ever worry about seeding or positioning. I, I think all I worry about is trying to be a better team. I think if you, if you become a better team, uh, you win more games, you're more ready for the tournament. But if you can be fooled by, you know, uh, worrying about that other stuff. Is it, it's important, though, to come into that tournament playing well. How do you feel like, you know, what do you feel like the areas are that you really need to, to show that in, in these last few games? Well, we have to defensive rebound better. You know, that's probably our worst area defensively. Uh, we have to guard the ball like crazy and gap up and make sure that we, we do a better job of keeping guys in front of us and then continue to guard at that three line. If you don't guard the three line, that's a recipe for disaster. What are you seeing from George Mason? Good team. You know, uh, like everybody else has had a little bit of ups and downs here and there. Uh, but you're talking about, you know, really good guards in Livingston and Kyer. Uh, good, strong, big guy in Reuter. Uh, and then, you know, uh, uh, just a good overall team with good depth. They have probably some of the best depth in the league. Uh, how's Sin? I mean, it's day to day with him. Like he. He's had a lot of irritation this week, so we'll see. Uh, you know, again, it's hard because he's such a key piece for us, but we'll just, uh, if he can play, he'll definitely play. You know, he's a tough kid. What do you feel like um, the opportunity is for not just this game, but you've got Bonaventure, St. Louis, some other teams that are some in a similar place as you in the standings in this conference? Well, I think, you know, we have a difficult schedule. There's no question uh, these are the better teams in the league. Uh, it's just going to come down to who's playing their best basketball in, in late February and March. And, uh, you know, we just have to figure out ways to win and win close games because we know they're all going to be close. Do you feel like winning close games, especially on the road, is something that can help prepare a team for when you get into those kind of crazy tournament times? Well, I think all 31 games help prepare you. And we've been, we've certainly been in a lot of different situations against a lot of different things. And uh, we're no longer a young team. We've been, We've been through the wars pretty much, and a lot of emotional games, a lot of tough games, a lot of games that came down to the last possession. So those have all prepared us, and hopefully now the ball bounces the right way for us and we get a break or two and we make enough plays and we'll have a really successful season.